Hello everyone, this is Isabel. I'm at ITW 2024 and today I'm joined by Chuck Parrish. He's General Manager at Telarix. Chuck, welcome to my hot seat. Hi Isabel, it's great to be here at ITW with you. I hope you're having a, a great conference and I uh, appreciate you taking the time to do the interview. So Chuck, the Tomia Interconnect business has rebranded to Telarix. What's behind this change, the, the rebrand? We've got a, a couple of reasons, uh, actually a number of reasons, but a couple of them are the, really the most important ones. Number one reason is that we want our customer base to know that we are laser focused on this industry. As we're part of Tomia, that may not be so obvious, but as Telerix, where that brand name has been synonymous with the wholesale interconnect business for prior 15 years or so, um, we believe that that really shows our commitment in the long term. The other thing is that Lumen Group, who's bought us uh, back in 2022, is committed to buy and hold companies for forever. That's given us a lot of freedom to make a commitment to the long term success of this industry and our commitment to our, to our customers. So we think the name puts us back to that and will make it um, real and tangible to our customers what we're trying to do. Okay, so you're an industry expert. What do you think is the biggest challenge at the moment for operators and carriers in, in this industry? Uh, there, there are quite a number of, of challenges that are there. Some of them are the same old traditional ones like, for example, price list and the volume around them and how do you ingest a price list and how do you validate all the non-standard formats and things that come through. Um, there are um, other challenges in the market. For example, uh, one of the most recent things that came up in the voice space is 60-60 uh, rounding on origin-based destinations, and that's causing fits in certain parts of the market, and we've got to be able to adapt and, and handle those types of things. Um, on the SMS front, um, you're dealing with uh, price lists that have um, delivered and um, submitted uh, different prices, you've got to normalize those things and bring them into a system that has to make good decisions on costing, pricing, and routing. And those are real real challenging things to do when there's not enough standardization uh, across the market. But beyond that, that's kind of the mechanical things that are there. But the actual, the big pressure in the business right now is the shrinkage of the, the voice minutes business, especially in the international market. Uh, implementation of Volte uh, roaming is reducing more and more of those international voice minutes. So the real challenge is how do, how, do, how do the operators and how do we support them in pivoting into new revenue streams that can actually really help them drive their business forward and become more of a growth engine again. So a lot of challenges to contend with. So at, at Telarix, how do you help your customer address all of these challenges, at least some? Sure. Yeah, at, at Telarix, we've got, um, for some of the traditional problems, we've got our IX Link platform that handles uh, priceless receipts. We we're ha give a high level of automation around receipt, ingestion, validating those priceless, making sure they're conforming to the contractual terms. And um, on the other front, um, we have taken our platform that served our customer base well in the wholesale voice business for quite some time. And we've added support for SMS A to P. We've added support now for our cloud numbers or virtual numbers. Um, so we're trained to help our customer base actually increase, add new revenue streams and increase existing ones, primarily focused on the enterprise space, a little bit more away from just the pure carrier to carrier uh, wholesale market. Okay. So if you could leave the people watching us with one message, what would it be? message I would leave them with is we are 100% focused on our customers. We're very committed. Um, we really are, you know, we, we are unwavering in our commitment to them. And we're going to go forward with you in delivering, helping you find operator, operator uh, solutions, operator to enterprise solutions, and really across all those things I've mentioned before, SMS, RCS, RBM, uh, cloud numbers, virtual numbers, and even getting into some of the application-oriented things like NAS and API-oriented uh, services that are being developed in the current market. Okay, so you're very busy, I see. Very busy, yes, we, but we can do it. <laughs> thank you so much, Chuck, for a great interview. Thank you, Isabel. Everyone, thank you for watching, and until my next hot shot. <laughs>